In the tapestry of time and faith, Israel emerges as a land with profound biblical significance, a stage for prophecies that resonate through the ages. The Bible weaves tales of dispersion and return, envisioning the homecoming of the Jewish people. In 1948, the establishment of the modern state of Israel echoed these ancient verses, seen by many as the fulfillment of divine promises. Yet, amidst this historical rebirth, Jerusalem, claimed by Israelis and Palestinians, stands as a contentious focal point in both international relations and biblical prophecy. The sacred Temple Mount adds another layer to the narrative, with prophecies dreaming of a third temple and potential conflicts. As the story unfolds, the New Testament introduces prophecies of the Antichrist and the vision of Armageddon, offering a captivating glimpse into the intertwining threads of history and faith. Israel's profound significance traces back to ancient biblical prophecies, particularly those detailing the dispersion and return of the Jewish people. The Old Testament weaves a narrative of exile, a period when the Israelites face scattering across different lands. Prophets such as Jeremiah and Ezekiel played crucial roles in documenting these events, highlighting the hardships faced by the Israelites during their time away from their homeland. Yet, amid the challenges, a promise of restoration emerged. The Old Testament carries the hopeful message of the eventual regathering of the scattered Israelites in their homeland. This promise resonates through the pages of the scriptures, offering the glimpse of a future where the people of Israel would once again find unity in their ancestral land. Fast forward to the 20th century, and the establishment of the modern state of Israel in 1948 is widely regarded as a tangible fulfillment of these age-old prophecies. The return of the Jewish people to their homeland after centuries of dispersion marked a historic moment, bringing the biblical narrative into the realm of reality. For many believers, this event holds a special significance, validating the enduring power of ancient prophecies. The establishment of Israel in 1948 is, therefore, more than a geopolitical event, it is a testament to the enduring nature of biblical promises. It symbolizes a homecoming for a people whose history is intricately interwoven with the scriptural tapestry. The significance of this historical milestone is not only political, but carries deep spiritual and cultural implications, serving as a living connection between the ancient prophecies of the Old Testament and the modern reality of the state of Israel. Jerusalem, a city claimed by both Israelis and Palestinians, holds a special place in history and religion. It's not just a piece of land on a map, it symbolizes a rich tapestry of historical and religious significance. This importance goes beyond politics, it's deeply rooted in biblical prophecy, adding layers of complexity to the city's identity. The city's contested nature is like a spotlight in international relations, drawing attention from various factions who desire control and sovereignty. This tussle for dominance often creates challenges, making it a focal point for global discussions and negotiations. Jerusalem's historical significance dates back centuries, and its role in prophecy adds another dimension to its complexity. The Old Testament of the Bible mentioned Jerusalem numerous times, emphasizing its sacred nature. This religious importance intensifies the emotions surrounding the city, making it a touchstone for many faiths. The ongoing challenges faced by those seeking a peaceful resolution highlight the intricacies of the Jerusalem dilemma. The city's divided status reflects the broader struggle for harmony in the region. Efforts to find a balanced and equitable solution persist, with the hope that one day Jerusalem can serve as a symbol not only of historical and religious unity, but also of peace and coexistence. In understanding the complexities of Jerusalem, we gain insight into the delicate balance required to navigate the cultural, religious, and political intricacies of this ancient city. It remains a place where the past, present, and future converge shaping the narrative of a city that holds significance far beyond its geographical boundaries. The Temple Mount, nestled at the center of Jerusalem, is a place of great spiritual significance for Jews, Christians, and Muslims alike. Its historical importance is deeply rooted, particularly with the documented existence of the First and Second Temples. These structures stood as symbols of faith and worship, shaping the identity of the people who revered them. Biblical prophecies cast a profound shadow over the Temple Mount, elevating its importance beyond historical context. The anticipation of a third temple adds another layer to the sacredness of this ground. For many, this expectation is tied to the fulfillment of age-old prophecies, creating a sense of spiritual longing and significance. However, this anticipation also introduces complexities, 
especially regarding potential conflicts surrounding the construction of the Third Temple. The shared custodianship of the Temple Mount poses a delicate balance, requiring careful consideration of the religious sensitivities of multiple faiths. The interplay between historical claims, religious beliefs, and geopolitical realities adds nuance to the discussions surrounding this sacred site. In exploring the religious implications of the Temple Mount, we delve into the hearts of diverse faiths and the common ground they seek to share. It becomes a microcosm of the broader challenge of harmonizing different religious perspectives in a shared space. Navigating this delicate balance is crucial for fostering understanding and cooperation, transcending the potential tensions that could arise from competing interests. The Temple Mount, with its rich history and multifaceted significance, stands as a testament to the shared heritage of humanity, calling for a harmonious coexistence that respects the diverse beliefs that converge at this sacred location. In the vast landscape of Christian beliefs, the New Testament takes center stage, introducing prophecies that cast a light on the future, particularly concerning Israel and the broader world. The Antichrist and the Vision of Armageddon Though complex in concept, are discussed here in simple terms to provide insights into how these prophecies shape modern Christian perspectives. The New Testament, building upon the foundation of the old, unfolds a narrative that extends into the future. The concept of the Antichrist, mentioned in several books like 1 John and 2 Thessalonians, is essentially a figure or force opposed to Christ. While interpretations vary, Christians generally view the Antichrist as a symbol of evil that will emerge, stirring a period of turmoil. Armageddon, often portrayed as a colossal battle in popular culture, originates from the Book of Revelation. In simpler terms, it represents a climactic showdown between good and evil, a final confrontation leading to a new era, marked by divine justice and the establishment of God's kingdom on earth. Understanding these New Testament prophecies is like peering into a crystal ball for many Christians, the diverse theological perspectives surrounding these predictions add depth to the tapestry of beliefs. Some interpret the Antichrist as a symbolic force of evil, while others anticipate a specific individual. The vision of Armageddon, likewise, is approached with a spectrum of beliefs, ranging from literal battles to symbolic transformations. These prophecies play a significant role in shaping how Christians perceive the future, intertwining the fate of Israel with eschatological events or events related to the end times. The modern lens through which believers interpret these prophecies contributes to the rich diversity of theological thought within the Christian community. For many, the anticipation of these future events becomes a source of hope and a reminder of the overarching narrative of redemption and renewal found in Christian teachings. It's a roadmap that guides believers through the complexities of the present with the promise of a future where justice, peace, and divine purpose prevail. In essence, the New Testament prophecies concerning Israel bridge the gap between ancient wisdom and contemporary faith. They offer believers a framework for understanding the unfolding of events, encouraging contemplation on the broader questions of existence, destiny, and the ultimate purpose of humanity in the grand narrative of the Christian faith. As we wrap up this journey through Israel's role in biblical prophecy, we see a story that blends ancient predictions with modern realities. The establishment of Israel in 1948 stands as a living echo of age-old prophecies, bringing a sense of fulfillment to many. Jerusalem, a city at the heart of this narrative, remains a symbol of both unity and contention, reflecting the complexities of international relations and ancient scriptures. The Temple Mount, a spiritual cornerstone, holds dreams of a third temple, yet with the potential for conflicts. The New Testament introduces concepts like the Antichrist and Armageddon, adding layers to the tapestry of beliefs. In these simple words, we find a reminder that Israel's journey intertwines history, faith, and the shared hopes of people across the globe, offering a glimpse into the intricate dance between the past and the unfolding future.